So in my uh, living here in Florida, you can actually smell it. This is called a Lang Lang tree, and there used to be a shop on Madison Avenue with the same name that made that great jewelry. So that's one of the little outposts here. And there's lights so that you can come in. Mm, the fragrance is amazing. Walk through here at night. And now we're coming up to a koi pond. So we'll take a look at that. There's some beautiful um, orchids planted. Spanish moss hanging. And a beautiful koi pond. So on this day of rain before this terrible storm arrives, the koi's are they're pretty much here alone right now waiting for the tourists. But I'm their only tourist. This is the Lapidus Fountain, donated by the Lapidus family who built the Fountain Blue Hotel. And there's a plaque here. It's donated by uh, Peggy Mackey. Fan, uh, fa it's called the Peggy Mackey Fountain. And it's a tribute to love. Very beautiful. And we're going to continue around. There's actually a live turtle sitting out, which is so nice to see. See him down there? There's a cute little turtle, and there's a couple more. How sweet. They have an event room for people that are interested in doing events here. This is a gumbo limbo tree. It's surrounded by them in Boca. And there's actually a guided tour. So if you want to do this through your cell phone, you can. But it's kind of a nice vibe on a rainy day. There's water on all the leaves. So they're, they're extra sparkly and beautiful. I do love the garden, though, in, uh, at the Society of the Four Arts in Palm Beach. It's really got everything. But our next stop, this is a sea gray. There's a lot of staghorn fern hanging from that tree, which is amazing. That's sea gray, right there. And 